Hey guys, I created this fancy little level right here, so my game needs more levels now. How do I do that? I'm here right in the third person example map and I have this one open. Right in the content, third person blueprint, maps. This is my level I'm currently at. So, how do we add new levels? Simply go to file, new level, then choose one of those. For this example, I choose time of day. Then I will save this one, Control S and I look into the map where my levels is, or you can create a new folder for that, and I name this, for example, level 2. So, now this one is saved, and I can open my level 2, and my level I got right here. So, how do I switch between these levels? For example, you can make a trigger, so when your player collides with the trigger, you go to another map. Let me show you. Right-click, go to Blueprint Class, Actor, and let's name this one Trigger. For example, open it up, then let's add a plane, let's make it bigger, and let's also add a box collision, because this collision, this will check if your player collides with it, for example like this, have your box collision selected, click compile, and look here for uncomponent begin overlap, click the plus icon, drag off it, and then type in level. You can open level by name or by object reference. I will show both. Let's show this one first by name. So we name this one level 2. If you use capital, use a capital here as well. Click compile and drag this into your level. For example, I can drag this one over here. So when a player gets onto this platform, it will jump to my other level my level 2. Then when my player comes to that level I need to add another trigger to go back to the first level to show you how you can add multiple. So now when my player goes up here and I move here now I'm in my second map my level 2. Now before I make changes to my second level I need to save this one go to file then go to save all or Control shift s and then I can open my second level. Right now it is pretty empty, but I can make another trigger. I use this one to go to level 2. But let's say if the player falls off, he goes back to the start. So he has to start the game all over again. I can right click, make a new blueprint class, actor. And let's call this one a fall trigger. Open it up. And this time I don't need a plane, but I can add a box collision for example. Scale the box collision up like this, make it bigger, compile, and once again, go to on component, begin overlap, hit the plus icon, drag off it, level, and we use by name, but I will show you also this one, you can use both by the way, and we got the third person example map for this, hit compile save, so when the player collides with his fall trigger, he will fall down to level 1 namely the map that we started with. So let's scale our map up. So big enough because when our player jumps over it and he doesn't touch this trigger when he falls, then it won't work. So I also have this drag this a little bit down as well. So we really can fall into it. Okay, Ctrl S, save for this one. So let's go back here, hit play. Now when I enter this one here, I should go to level 2. Okay, all is fine. I have a beautiful level right here. And when I lose the game and I jump off it, I hit that collision and I go back to level 1. And you can test this out a couple of times if it works. Now if it doesn't work, check if your box collision is big enough or onto your object. And also in your second level, if this also works. You can still tweak your triggers where you go back to your fall trigger or trigger here. And this is basically how you can easily change between levels in Unreal Engine 5.